Dude, you're in the air for a fucking while. You were high for sure. Yeah. Oh my god! Oh! <laughs> There. <laughs> Drink plenty of fluids on a hot day and uh, get high in the music, not the drugs. <laughs> So I need to get my kill switch spliced into this really cheap dead man switch that I got off of Amazon. So I'm going to my buddy Dylan Hughes' shop who does Formula Drift. And has a pretty sick in-house electrical guy. <laughs> this is my friend Carlos. We work together, he helps us out on all the race cars in here. Uh, works for us full time and uh, travels around the country to all the FD events with us. And he's a weapon at wiring and pretty much anything that has to do with anything that goes fast. Yeah, no, we can we can make it so that it'll. I'll put a connector here that you could run either or. Damn, yeah, we'll see, <laughs> wrinkly brain guy. <laughs> One side of this is grounded, and the other side, when you go like this, will shoot ground this way, and it just tells your your mm. bike to shut off. So, does it uh, need that? I, I see, it, it already lost me. <laughs> and that's basically. Do it again, like explain it like I'm three. <laughs> okay. That's a plus. And look how factory that shit is. Dude. Well we haven't even heat heat shrunk it yet, but whatever. That's it, dude. Now I can go straight to Hillcom events too and not have to like change anything, which has never happened before. Um, I'm going to Robbie Madison's house tomorrow to try to learn backflips, and he asked if I could put one of those kill switches on just in case the bike went flying. It's super easy to burn a foam pit down, so if safety's safe, we put that thing on there. I was way more nervous about flipping yesterday when I thought I was just going to go 75 to foam, but Maddo is kind of trying to convince me to just do super kicker first, which is still gnarly, but it's only like 45 feet as opposed to 75 feet, so like the speed difference is a lot better. A little uneasy in the stomach this morning. Damn, maddo has been doing some work to the compound. He's got the whole like deck all flat. Yeah, like Vicky was sitting over there and I'm like, got the hose. I was like pulling it back, and the next thing I was all, shoom! And like before I knew it, I was on my ass down there. I come <laughs> up, and she like ran over, and she's like, you're right. I'm like, I don't know how, I'm fine. <laughs> couple puddles, huh? Yeah, a couple of them. Yeah. If you just stand up first and come uh -huh. in holding that position, then it's like you already your mind already knows you're doing a flip, you're already committed, you got your balance, everything's yeah. like kind of good, and then you just like start from, from a good reference point. Okay. Right. Well, I know you got it, you're so talented. Oh stop oh, first one. <laughs> <laughs> Go over I'm the stoked table. you're doing the 45 first. This yeah, is me too. Cool. Dude, yeah. if I was lining up a 75 right now, I'd be so nervous I don't think I could do it. Like I would I'd mess up in the air. Hey! <laughs> like that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, you're in the air for a fucking while. You were high for sure. Yeah. yeah. You do too much to go. Yeah, you know, just same, look, same look throttle, same throttle. Uh, Fuck you, that like. No, but just one more try. Yeah, no more Same exactly. Yeah. Yeah. I guess I keep stalling and we just do it. This isn't my job, my hobby, my habit. It's sad, but this is my life. Welcome to our mission. That was super clean, brother. Yeah, it's 
scary like going into something where like you really I'm just like you don't really have that much confidence. You don't know what you're doing. Yeah, I've never yeah. Done it, but I'm like, yeah. alright, I'm just doing it. I'm just gonna pull back. Yeah. So scary. That's like you the nailed it. Part. That, that is sick. the hardest part is the mental like just commit to the first one. Yeah. And you sit okay. down, come into it. Okay, okay. You just tell me like cruising, oh yeah, this ain't no thing. Just, yeah. But then you pull way too hard because you're standing up and like everything's happening. A lot of things are happening mm -hmm. in the last minute. So just like take one thing out of what's happening, already be standing up okay. and then just do your pull. Usually when people give me advice, if it doesn't feel very comfortable to me, I just kind of write it off because I go with my judgment more than someone else's. But in this particular case, when Rod Madison's giving you advice, you kind of listen. you're doing them like smooth off the 45 is insane and yeah when you go to the 75 you'll just be able to like it's a little smoother yeah, yeah. after a successful flip day at Maddo's, i went over to twitch's house to shoot some stuff in his pool we're still shooting for that film festival that i mentioned in the last video we were trying to get some kind of creative b-roll to throw into a special timeline we're i don't know we're working on stuff did you just fall Huh? Did you just fall? Yeah. 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 And uh, I almost drown in all my gear in the deep end of the pool. I've been close to drowning a lot in my life. Actually, that wasn't the closest I've been to drowning. <sighs> but it didn't help. Hopefully, you got something. <laughs> <laughs> I hope any of those shots worked out. Waking up with caffeine, I'm searching for a higher. I 